For geotraces, various types of instruments have been used, but irrespective of the method used, all data have to pass a quality check that looks at the blank levels and confirms the suitability of standard concentrations and the reproducibility of values for reference materials or consensus materials. This means you need to prepare a controlled blank, a calibration with standards in the appropriate concentration range, the repeated measurement of a suitable reference material. To ensure the accuracy of your measurements, measure the signal that you obtain in the absence of the sample material, but in otherwise similar conditions. This means that if you analyze particles from filters, you must process several filters that contain no sample exactly as you process your samples. This is called a procedural blank. Furthermore, you need to run samples of known compositions to validate your results. Some samples have been certified for their composition. They are called Certified Reference Materials, or CRMs. For an unknown marine sample, you can then measure the signal height and calculate the concentration from it. For many elements and isotopes in seawater, there are no CRMs available, but Geotraces has characterized some materials really well with analyses by different groups. These samples are called consensus materials. The detection limits of your ICP method is set by the standard deviation of the procedural blank. So make sure to have a sufficient number of blanks, otherwise your detection limit is suffering. Lab intercomparisons are also a regular part of the quality check. The recommended methods for analyses are outlined in the Geotraces cookbook. This is found together with other resources on the Geotraces webpage www.geotraces.org